All right, Greens family, this is Bomani time when we're live on Revolutionary Camp. We're at the Apartheid Museum in Johannesburg, and we just um, went through this uh, presentation. Uh, some people may have mixed feelings about it, but what I'm looking to do is just get uh, different people's opinion and this uh, feedback from their experience in the Apartheid Museum, and also there's a Nelson Mandela exhibition. So my brother, greetings brother, how are you? Just uh, give great, a quick brother. introduction to Warren. everyone. Yeah, this is Warren, Warren G. Uh, going with Africa for the Africans, the South African tour, Dynamite, it's, 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 a, it's a lot we getting from this. Um, we in Johannesburg, South Africa, birthplace of the revolution. Uh, we at the uh, Apartheid Museum and they have a section in it uh, for Nelson Mandela and it's a lot that I've learned uh, of his movements. Um, one, uh, 10 years before the Montgomery bus, bus boycott, they had a boycott here in South Africa uh, and they shut down the whole bus system for four days. The, the people relented in four days. Uh, so I think in my thinking that Dr. King probably got the idea for the Montgomery bus boycott from here. Um, also, uh, just the history of revolution in South Africa, this museum, it's just so much factual information you can get that you're not going to get in America, even in the history of America, they're not going to give you a lot. Uh, it was a lot more people than Mandela, hundreds, just like in the civil rights movement in the United States. It was hundreds of people. We don't know their names, they don't get plaques, they don't get this, but it was hundreds of people who made that revolution happen as it did the civil rights movement in the United States. But this is a must come. When you come to Johannesburg, you must come here. It takes you about two hours, two and a half. You have to read every pamphlet, every, um, they have them on boards of history. You have to read every single one of them because it's a picture they're taking you through, going all the way back to the 20s, all the way through. And you'll see uh, women, uh, Indians, Asians, uh, Africanas, the boards, what they did. You'll see all the pieces of uh, the people and how they fought against yeah, right. and for who all, uh, all of the people who supported apartheid, uh, even people in the United States. Um, and you see the people who fought against it, other people in other parts of the world. Um, also, you see a part where uh, uh, Mahatma Gandhi, his role in, in this movement. So, no, this is, this is dynamic, very powerful presentation. Uh, definitely bring your children. This is one you have to bring your children here to see. So, yeah, that's what I got from it. So that that sounds like a powerful presentation. So it was like a lot of a number of black people in there learned about the the history. Well, no, it was not in there. It was more white people and, and Europeans in there. At about ninety percent, right? Ninety to one. Yes, ninety to ten percent. Yes, yes. But it was a lot of African Americans in there, a lot of Africans in there. Uh, but they they were in there also. Um, but, but it's, it's, a, it's something that we have to do uh, there, to my opinion, I've been to the Civil Rights Museum in Washington, D.C. in America, and theirs here, theirs here is way more intense, way more factual uh, of the day-to-day, -day. And, and they highlight way more people than we do in the one in the United States, the Civil Rights Museum. Um, and they here, they show more reality of what happened, beatings and, and killings and stuff. They show that here. They, didn't, they don't show that in the, in the civil rights uh, one in, in America. So, so that's a difference. And um, that's very important. Absolutely, brother. Appreciate uh, the energy. Now, one of the main things that um, I wanted to uh, just um, ask you about, once you started going into the actual apartheid section yes. outside of uh, Nelson Mandela, what, what was the most traumatic thing that you saw? Um, I mean, it's all, it's all traumatic. I'm mean, just saying that when you go through it, it's a constant fight of oppression and revolution. You see the constant distinction and fighting, battle by battle, protest by protest, law passing of past book laws and what they doing, and also the grassroots organizers, women, uh, other minority groups, African brothers, uh, you know, you actually see year by year, month by month, blow by blow, uh, what, what took place through this whole revolution. And so it's not just Mandela. Mandela, as we have Dr. King in the United States, here they have Mandela. But to me, the difference is they have went more deeper 
behind Mandela of the people who actually did it, whereas in the United States we still, Dr. King, you know, hundreds of other people that we need to know about that we don't. At least here, they have, at least they let you know of the more people who actually did equal or even more than Mandela did in reference to the revolution. So, so that's the difference that I see. Absolutely, brother. And that's it. Like, like we tell you, family, red, black, green, and gold are colors. And um, we're going to keep it strong. So, brother, say, Warren G., appreciate your energy, man. You, and uh, Thank appreciate you for you being this a trip. scholar. I mean, this is a, this is a must see. Any, any other place where this Pan African is, uh, uh, culturalist, socialist, spiritualist, whatever you are, this has to be on your bucket list. You have to get here. This is like Mecca to, to Islam. This is, this is the, for any revolutionary person, you must come to this museum. I say. Absolutely, family and family. You see the website on there? Join us next year, November 2020, for the same South Africa journey. So everything that we're showing you is what you're going to be experiencing. So family, once you check everything out, um, yes. by going on the website, just reach out to us and uh, we keep you connected. So appreciate you, brother. Keep it appreciate strong. Appreciate you, brother. I say, I say.